They're right there. Put some lotion on. Oh, I need to throw my clothes in the dryer. about a cup of coffee, but I don't know. Let me see if there's anybody here. Oh, a few. Nobody said hello. Anybody there? Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and make me a cup of coffee since there's nobody said hello. Give it a few more minutes. And I'll be right there. Y'all, if you give me the thumbs up, I'm going to start a cup of coffee. That's all. I'm just making me a cup of coffee. Okay, fine. Hi, Miss Sue. Hi, Gail. Both girls. Yay. Jane's here. Yay. Yay. Happy Saturday, everybody. Let's see. I didn't miss anybody. Okay. All right. Yes, I'm just fixing me a cup of coffee. And um, I want to tell y'all a funny story. Um, I bet you've never had this happen to you, you darlings that are here first. I just guarantee y'all have never had this happen. Okay. So, uh, I'm going to see Jackson tomorrow at his house. And my son, well, both my sons, all my children love my banana bread. And I make it in the muffin form. Um so I was going to try to make the banana bread today to give it one day to see it because it's so much better at least a day after you make it. Like some things, potato salad, you know, slaw. So anyway, I was going to try to get that done this morning. And I knew I had picked up uh, extra eggs, butter, getting prepared to make it this weekend. And guess what? The most staple item I did not have. And I was like, now I know I've got all-purpose flour. You know, look, I've got two dolls. This one is a really nice one. It's little girls and boys. And you should look up and see how much that is. But I'm going to give a good deal on it if somebody wants it. No, I didn't forget the bananas. I had no all-purpose flour. And I, I was like, I hardly ever use all-purpose flour, but just baking and, you know, and I haven't baked in a while. And I went to the, I got to thinking about Morgan. And sometimes if I'm up before she leaves, I see her with a makeup brush. She's got a big Ziploc bag, something in it, and she dabs it in her hair. And I thought, I bet that's my all-purpose flour. So I went and looked, and sure enough, the all-purpose flour I think it's cocoa powder that she mixes with it to make it like for a brunette instead of so white. And she applies that with her makeup brush in her roots on a day that's not hair wash day to absorb the oil. Now that's old timey, isn't it? I don't know where she got that from. I've never done it, but I already try it. Well, no, I don't have any oil anymore. <laughs> I don't have any oil anymore. That's how you know you're getting older, isn't it? No more oil. Uh, but anyway, so yeah, I couldn't make my bread because I don't have any all-purpose flour because Morgan's putting it in her hair. Let me fix my coffee. So have y'all ever had that happen to you? Have y'all ever had that happen to you? 
Is it not? Is that not hilarious? Jeez Louise! So now I'm gonna I'm gonna try to make it tonight. I'm gonna have to go and get me some flour so I can make it tonight. Cause I don't want to wait and make it tomorrow. Cause uh, you know it's just so much better after it sits a day or so. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna take my baby some banana bread. That'd be Jake, that baby. And get to see Jackson. Morgan's going, and I'm go I want to read him a book. That's what I want to do. And you know, it might I may be the first person to ever read him a book. I don't know if his mother or father has, but I want to ask if I can, and hopefully nobody minds if I'm the first one to read them a book, but if it means something to somebody, I won't if they don't want me to. <sighs> you know what I mean? Uh, Alright, so I got purses, laptop bags, some vintage bags right here that I wanted to show. A um, couple of really nice ties. Uh Wonder if that will work. Yeah, it'll work. Yeah, it'll work. Um, let's see. Put you a little cocoa powder in there because you don't want it white. Do you still have oil? Well, you're a lucky person, I suppose. Hi, Miss Lizzie. How are you, darling? How's everybody today? Happy Saturday. Yeah, try. I'm sure if you Google that. She had to get that from somewhere. So I was going to tell you about that story. And um, what else was I was going to tell y'all? Um, what was it? That happened. I can't remember. Maybe I'll think of it. Hi, Miss Suzanne. You missed my funny story. You'll have to rewind and listen to it. <laughs> it had to do with Morgan. Oh, Mark's here. Hi, Mark. Let's say. Well, thank you. What do you mean you are right? Works well for you. What does that mean? Are you out uh, dashing? I hope you have a good day. And I've got two coffee cups right here. Let me go back and see what he's saying. I don't know what works well for me. Yeah, I can't help it. I'm going to let a compliment slip by. Take them. I'll take them wherever I can get them. And I even fish for them sometimes. Not from particular people, just y'all. <laughs> um, let's see. Home from work. Okay. So, yeah, I gotta make, I'll be making me some banana bread about 10 o'clock tonight. Um, let's see. There was something else I wanted to tell you. Well, we had senior. Oh, I talked about that last night. I forgot I was on here last night. Jeez Louise. Y'all make you a cup of coffee. Yay, relaxing. You think you are younger and what? Am I one of those people that gets better looking as they get older? Where I used to go to church. There's happy days. Where I used to go to church in my younger years, 20s, and when my children were little. The pastor of the old country church and his wife were people like that. Because they do their anniversary and stuff. They showed pictures from when they were teenagers. And they were just about. Let's just say every year they look more handsome more more handsome you know i don't know I, that's the word for it more easy to look at i don't know what to say so maybe i'm one of those jane if i just if i just accept your nice compliment maybe i'm one of those oh sorry lizzie i'm sorry here i am sitting here acting up and silly and 
some of y'all are having hard times. So I want to be sensitive to that. But Happy Day said, no, be yourself, Missy. That's why I came, so I can feel better. So I pray anybody that needs to feel better feels better. If I could reach out and hug you, I would. It's like, I know how it feels. Sometimes I just want to be petted. I was telling my friend that the other day. Because my, my grandma, she petted me. You know, all the time. Just what I needed. Just a little love and affection and um, affirmation and validation. You know, who, who doesn't like that? So, okay, Miss Lizzie, honey. Benjamin Button, you are. Ben, what's Benjamin Button? I know Benjamin Button, but I want to watch that movie. Well, let me get started. Um, I'll just go ahead and show. I don't know if Gail L's here. But this is so pretty, this doll. And this, the box looks great. Tulip and Ducky. Tulip and Ducky is who this one is. This one's 2004. And this, wait a minute. Yeah, the Barrington. What did I say? The Boyd? This is the Barrington. And she is in beautiful, perfect condition. Check her out. Down to her beautiful prairie dress. Well, let me move this over just a little bit. See if that'll help. Look at her beautiful little dusty rose sweater, her hat, and ducky and tulips. So I don't know which is which, but do you see her little, do y'all see her little um, dog right here? She's got a little dog in her hand. Isn't that a beauty? That's a Barrington bear. And like I said, she's a 2004 perfecto condition uh, maybe it was this one down here that was yeah this one down here is the boys Boyd bear that one if you look that up was pricey hi harry um she's got her authentic oh can't say it authenticity authentication card which is a nice thick piece of cardboard unlike usual um but anyway isn't she beautiful 28 if anybody wants her 28 dollars she's perfect condition and there's her little doggy i don't know it looks like a what kind of dog is that y'all i was gonna say maybe a yorkie but and it's got a little bow in its hair so 28 on that one. This is available for 24 hours after the replay. Yes, our prayers are with you. And here is the other one. This has kind of got weight to it. This one does. It's little girls and boys. And this one looks so um, beautifully done. I mean, it's not ever been taken out of the box. You can tell that. Look here. This one starts at 65. Um, she's never been taken out and I really don't want to, but you gotta see her. So she's in red, she's got a little bear on her dress. Do a face reveal. She's still got the stocking on, the net on her head, her hair. She's gorgeous. There's her hat, there's the stand. Let you get a look, she's got a little titty. She's got a little teddy bear in there. And there's some weight to this one. This one starts at 65, y'all. And you can look that one up. She's worth it. She's worth that. And it she is, um, let me tell you what year. If anybody did want to look her up. I need to put this back on her face. I don't know what year she is. I'll hold it up if anybody's interested. She's beautiful. Um, her authentication card has, is right in the, in the envelope. 
And let's see if I can find a name for this one. This just says little girls and boys. So boy bear. Okay, this is this box box contains right here. That's still not her name. There's the info down there. Hi, Gypsy. You know, if I did collect something, I think I could get into collecting dolls. Gail does. How long have you been collecting dolls, Gail? Where do you put them on? Now, that, that would take up some room. It could be costly, but you know, Gail, are, are you in love with or have you seen the, what do they call the realborns or something? Reborns. Y'all, those dolls are so expensive, but they look and feel and jiggle and weight of and everything a real baby. I think Jackson looks like a little painted porcelain doll. Hi, Gypsy, darling. How are you? And Happy Days and Jane. Who else is still here? Lizzie. Okay, that, that was two non-clothings. I have two coffee cups. Do y'all remember this? Um, I think it was a comic. Shoebox. Um, this woman right there, I'm reminded of. Actually, oh, it says Wanda, Nina. It must be a lot of different ones. I can't remember what this is about. But this one's 15 if anybody likes it. Chatty Kathy that still works. Oh, it's a nice coffee cup. 15. And I have a, a vintage Yorkie. It's got Thailand on the bottom and a pretty little Yorkie. I think I would like to have a Yorkie too, but I think about that, y'all. Zoe's going downhill, but I, I wouldn't do it for a while. I'll read this while we're waiting to see if any other friends come in. It says, Yorkshire Terrier. Do you, Jane? I would love to see pictures of them sometime. Not if it's busy work, but I, I've watched unboxing videos of those dolls. I love it. The Yorkie, as it is affectionately called by its lovers, is similar in appearance to the Australian Australian Silky Terrier. One of the most popular dogs today, the Yorkie rivals the Chihuahua as the world's smallest dog. Though this dog loves to make friends, it has a fearless nature and is very alert, making it an excellent watchdog for its size. And we're talking about the Yorkie. Oh, if anybody wants that one, we'll do 10 bucks. 10 bucks. Coffee cups. Gypsy, did you see the, the horse doll I had? I'm going to go ahead and show y'all these. Um, my nose is itching. I'm going to go ahead and show you some bags that I have now. Well, I'll pick up uh, Mish. It's Mish bags. Mish. Where is that? Um, I'm failing at remembering her name. I'm not failing at remembering her. But do y'all know who I'm talking about? Um funny name she did mesh she sold mesh bags she knows a lot of, of it and they're they're nice bags but i can't remember her name her youtube name i haven't seen her i just a lot of people i've not seen in a while but anyway this one's gold tone okay y'all <clears throat> does it not have a strap you hear it like this I don't know about that. Let's put it right here. I don't know about that. All right, let's see what I have now. A Kipling. Kiplings are great bags. They're pricey. Do y'all like them? Have you ever had one? I've sold a few of them. This one is an excellent new condition. Kipling. They'll last forever. No. Uh, these last forever. They're great. I keep clean. You can wash them, wipe them. So, 
lots of storage. Um, 20 bucks. 20 bucks start. That is a great price. And hardware looks excellent. Kind of looks like pewter hardware. This one doesn't look like it has anywhere to it whatsoever. 20 bucks. Are you kidding me? This is a great bag. And then it's got another back here. I have a crossbody kipling and I love it. And I used to have a black with hot pink inside. So that's that one. This like would fit a Bible or a magazine or something like that in it. $20, $20 if anybody likes that. And then I have what, um, this is a N case, I N case. It is absolutely perfectly new also. And this is a laptop bag, I'm pretty sure. I'll do a measure. And um, it's got the foam padding. And this one also has like a crushed velvet feel. There's your brand. Very Look, perfectly brand new. Um, and then, yeah, is that not a laptop bag? That's what I got it for. Yeah, I'm fairly sure it is. Very, very nice. Uh, I'll start this at 16 bucks if you could use one. Oh, I'm sorry about the rough week too, darling. These all look brand new. Let me do a measure on this so in case you need it for a laptop. So width 14, height 11. I mean, not height, length. 11 by 14. 11 by 14. Yeah. Anybody like or anybody could use or need. Brand new laptop bag. Real sturdy, nice handles. Um, and it's just brand new condition. Okay. Then I have a I have a Dooney and Burke that is authentic Dooney and Burke. It's an older one. This one, um, when I get purses, I don't get them if they need a clean, but this is worth somebody, if somebody loves because its handles are in excellent condition. This is the color of it. It could use a little clean. It's not in any way nasty type or, or a smell. It just could use a little clean. Um, inside looks really good. Needs a little clean there at the bottom. And the, the outside is the color it's supposed to be. I'm not saying that needs a clean. The inside, that has nothing. Then it has a middle. And all of the pulls, all of the pulls, everything is in. It just has that one spot there that needs to be cleaned. And that, I'm going to do a great deal on this because... I'm not really doing purses that much anymore. So, see the latch that comes over? All this is in beautiful condition. So, Vintage Dooney and Burke. Here's the bottom. Look what a nice size bag that is. I'll do 46 on that. $46 is heavy. It's a good bag. Vintage Dooney and Burke. I don't know how old it is. I don't know what model, make, anything. But it's an excellent condition. Excellent condition. Like I showed you, the one spot that stands out to be cleaned, look to look right there in the corner. Right there. Otherwise... I don't see anything. So, if anybody would like, it's a nice, heavy, great bag. Dooney and Burke. Hi, Wolfie. How are you? Hope you're doing great. I have two men's ties here. I don't really pick those up too much anymore. But if they're nice, I will. This one is uh, Wembley. Feels like silk. from imported fabric fiber made in USA. So maybe it's not. No, this one's polyester. 
Um, if anybody would like this one, let's just do $8. It's in great condition if you like. Greens, blues, burgundies, or maroons. Eight bucks. Excellent condition. Ooh, I might have to wear me a tie. I love that. <laughs> and I've got another one. That one's eight. This one, one of them I had gotten. Oh, I just loved this one, y'all. Look. This one is Noah's Ark. And I don't know if it's a silk or what it is, but let's look at it. You see the rain and the clouds. This one is 15, if any interest. It's polyester. This is by Renaissance. So 15, if any interest, on the Noah's Ark tie. Excellent condition. All right, a couple more bags. This is a bit, a little vintage, like I would call it like a carry on, or you could use it for whatever. It does have a hard bottom in it. It's, I believe, some type, you know, this, this material you can wipe and clean. And then it looks like tapestry on the outside. Vintage bag. Isn't that nice? It is in perfect condition. And I might end up keeping this one if nobody wants it. It says... Q-U-A-N-I-N-G. I can't really read it. But yeah, perfect condition. Um, seem like a great, just all-purpose bag. Um, let's see. Let's do, let's do 25 if anybody likes this. This is a good one. And it is in perfect condition. I'm trying to give you a size of it. I mean, there are no arrows, no dirty, no nothing. It has that um, hard bottom in it, which I think you can take out if you want. Um, so that's a great bag there and you can extend your, your, uh, strap if you need interest. Isn't that a beauty? Love it. Love it, y'all. Love, love. Isn't it great? I think 25 is a great price on that, don't y'all? Okay. No takers on any of this stuff so far. Next bag is a tick a tignello. Tig, I can't say it. Tignello. I've sold lots of these. This these ones are great leather. Right there. The hardware's great. It probably just give a little white. You can see what a nice, soft, malleable leather that is. Pebbled. And I'm gonna start this at 25. 25 on this beautiful black, perfect condition, handles everything. And you've got the hidden magnetic closure on this side. Love that print. Hidden magnetic closure on this side. And it's like, is this like a messenger where it zips down? You have more room. And in the middle, uh, you have another... Um, very nice bag for 25 bucks, y'all. Wow. That's great. There is so much life in it. It just really, and that's a little keychain attached with the brand. So, isn't that super cute? 25 on that Tick Mellow, if I'm saying it right. I can't remember how you say it. And this is what it looks like. We're going to town shopping, y'all. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go shopping. It's a great bag. At 25. Great price. Okay, let's get on to the clothing then. How's that? We'll get on to clothing. Let me get my little tickets. 
Y'all, I'll be on tomorrow with jewelry. I've got the stream set up. Seems like it's 11 a.m. or 1 p.m. I can't quite remember, but it's one of those. All right, so we have a lot. This is a beautiful caftan. Look at the colors of it. It's kind of native. It's Massimo. It's a smart to small, medium. They're about a one size fits all. This is so very soft. Gail, you'll love that purse, honey. The weight on it is great. There's the inside. Um, 17 on this. That is beautiful. And that's a great price on it. I'm putting it on show you. So y'all know I'm a 2X. I can wear it at a 2X. It's just basically a one size fits all. Gail, you're going to love it. I haven't done any wipes, anything on it. But um, you'll be very pleased with it. That is a great bag. Thanks so much, Gail L, for starting my sale out today on Saturday. Saturday, y'all, February's going to be over before long. Can you believe it? All right, let's see here. I'm going to write that down because I have a goal. Goals. Oh, did anybody like this at 17? This is what it looks like. This is soft, medium weight sweater. Okay, and it's a new condition. I don't know if anybody likes camo print. I've been giving some real steep discounts to the um, more winter clothing. So I've got this sweater here. This is a New Directions. Um, excellent. This will fit to extra large and might even fit up to 2X. If y'all want to measure to find out, I'll do it. So New Directions, 1 to 2X. If you're a 2X and you want it, I would uh, definitely try it on or measure it. Um, and let's do 12 bucks on it, $12. It's um, in between light and medium weight. All right, darling, let me measure it for you. We're only doing 12. And I have three nice men's shirts back here. For y'all. All right. Pets of pets. Oh, yeah. 42, 42 inches. And it has a soft and some stretch. If you want me to try it on, I can. It's really super soft. And it's a high-low. Look at that. But the front has still got a good length to it. Three-quarter sleeve. Try it on. All right. Let me do that. I, I've got my sports bra on, Gail, so it's not going to look great with that. I don't have my good bra on. But I will try. You see the little part right there? So I don't know if you think it fits me. I would wear it. It's just, uh, say what you think. I think you're smaller than me, but this bra is not quite right with it. Whatever you think, darling. I don't like the way it fits me. I don't know why. I mean, it's fine. It's just... I think it's a little bit too little for me. That's what I really think. So, I don't know how you'll feel about it, but let me know, honey. Pass. Okay, yeah, no problem. No problem. We want it to fit. Okay, Columbia men's beautiful turquoise colored shirt. Great condition here. 
It's the, um, you know, like the wicking type shirt, the outdoorsy to keep you cool, keep the sweat off. This is so nice. I'm going to ask, um, I'm going to ask, I'll do 16 on it if you could use it for your hubs or whoever. I'll do $16 on it, and that is an excellent deal. Now, this tag is gone, so let me see what I think. I think this is a men's large. It's a men's large, pretty sure, on this Columbia. Okay, very nice. Men's large. Uh, only 16 If you like it, I'm going to show you the other two. This one is Magellan. This one is a medium. It says fish gear. This is medium. And uh, excellent. Excellent. Make sure I see no signs of wear. I'll do 12 on the Magellan. It's a great brand. It's not cheap, but I'll do 12 on this one. It is a medium, if any interest. These are lightweight, cool, like wicking for summer. See that right there? And then it has that like that over it. Very nice. Men's medium. And then I had this one, which is by Habit. It is a medium. Same type. Same type of um, excellent fabric. And uh, whatever price the other one was, Jane, what, 12? I'll do 12 on this one. This is by Habit. All great brands, excellent new condition. This one is a medium, and again, it's the same light uh, dry wick type, if I'm calling that right, type of material. So, okay, you want the, the Magellan? You got it. <laughs> the Magellan is a medium. Oh, we did 12. And it is a, a beautiful men's shirt. So you got it, babes. Thanks, Gail. Very nice. Very nice. These are nice shirts. Yes, very nice. It's great. I don't know who you're getting that for, but I hope they love it. It's great. Thank you again, Gail Ale. All right. I have no interest in this one. Okay, this um, MSK, this is marked a medium. It's a new with tag. Little black dress. It's probably poly spandex. It's, it's not super thin. It's a, a, a pretty good weight. It's hard to convey that and show that. I um, love the zipper pull on this one. Um, let's see. Wow. Must be a good brand. That was 80 bucks retail. Let's do 25 if you like it. MSK is your brand. It does look and feel very well made. If anybody would like to measure, but it's marked to medium, and look, what a beautiful little black dress that is. Like, can't be kind of casual little black dress. $25. Marked a medium. Oh. It is so cute. Yeah, you can feel the good quality to it. Oh, had one more by Actually... I've got two. I want to show y'all something that I think is so freaking cool. I hardly come across these at all. Not this one, but I love this bag too. I remember buying this bag. I just took a chance on it because I thought someone would want it and I paid more than I normally do. This cute little bag. Uh, just skip it. Just skip that one for now. Here's what I really want to show you. Yeah, I think I do. I'm get, I'm going right to that next. I believe I do. Check this out. 
I guarantee those are vintage loose light handles. Is that not awesome? You can see the bubbles in there. And somebody has made this. And you can't see the detail, probably, but these are little, see them? Like little knobs all over it. Is this not an awesome bag? Perfect. Oh, and it had a little uh, Bible in it, and I wanted to leave the little Bible in it. And a little bell. Yeah, this is great. I know this is this is spectacular. Um, let's do let's start this one at twenty seven, twenty seven, and I'm gonna leave the little Bible in it unless somebody says take it out because of the weight. It's not much. Hi, Kirsten. I think it was it's a great one. Only twenty seven start. Fabulous. These handles, you can see the bubbles. I want y'all to see. Can you see the bubbles in it? All up and down these handles. I don't know if you can see it, but it's a great bag. I don't know. It speaks for itself. Oh, yeah, Kirsten likes it. These are in style now, y'all. So, see, the handles are everything. Only 27 is what we're at. Any other interest in this? Kirsten, you came in at the right time if you love it. I love it, too. It's fabulous. I don't think anybody carried it. There's None of this has got any little fine fibers coming off. Nothing. It's just perfection. And I don't know if they're loose sight, but I feel like it is. Let me see if I got my black light. I do have one. Let's see if they... Hi, Melly. How are you, darling? Are you feeling better? No, not really, Kirsten. They're not really doing anything. Does that make a difference to you? I don't know what they are, but they're super cool. It's a cool bag. And if, if no other interest... Sorry about that. Yeah, I'm definitely better and better. It's not contagious. I might, I don't know why I'm itching. Um, it's not contagious or anything. It's just I had that congestion. But the mucinex, I didn't take any. I didn't take any mucinex in two or three days. But I'm doing a lot better. All right, y'all. We're gonna call this great bag right here. Kirsten, did you still want it? Even though I'm not for sure these are low sight. I just kind of figure and assume, but I'm not sure. Do you still want it at that? Ain't that true, Happy Days? That's a true accessory right there. Or maybe that you're saying that's the main outfit. Oh, you so bougie vintage. It's already sold, darling. And you have to be registered to bid. So thank you for finding me. Feel free to get registered. Um, I think this is homemade, Millie. It doesn't have any, there's nothing. I feel like it's homemade. There's absolute nothing in it. I'm thinking it's homemade, but I could be wrong. Oh, you are registered? Okay. Well, tell me what to look up to find you, honey. Oh, no, don't be sorry. No problem. No problem at all. You are very welcome here. And just let me know when I have your info. I'll check it and you'll be good to go. Um, and welcome. How did you find me? I always ask that question. And um, my name's Misty. I do clothing and jewelry, mainly clothing. And um, several sales a week. And I invoice usually on, on the weekends, once a week on Sunday. So tomorrow, invoices will come out sometime tomorrow afternoon or night. And uh, I have a jewelry sale tomorrow. Um, we're doing some, um, the really low-priced game that I do sometimes. 
So Kirsten got that bag at 27. Thank you, darling. I love it. And I'm so glad you do. It's excellent. All right. Now, I don't know about this. This this is different to me. Oh, okay. Cool. Cool. Well, my info's pinned in blue, honey. You could register if you'd like. And, you know, feel welcome. Okay. This is a Ralph Lauren. Okay. I do know now. Somebody has done this. I don't know if y'all like it. I actually tried it on. I couldn't tie the back pieces, but I was like, this is a sexy shirt. It's a Ralph Lauren, okay, or Ralph Lauren, everybody you want to say it. It's 90% merino wool. It's 10% angora. And what somebody has done, I think is so creative. Here's your beautiful sweater. Look at the back. You talking about a sexy little get up here. Look at this. You just tie your backs. There's three of the, let's say, no, two, three. Hold on. Let me show you. And you're just going to have your pretty little back showing through. Um, this sweater, I did a great job here. I'm just temporarily doing this so I can show you. So this sweater is marked. A what? It's marked a extra, extra large. Look at the back. I love this. But I don't think it's everybody's cup of tea. Um, I love it. But it says XXL. If anybody wants this, I'll do $14 if you like it. 14 bucks. Ralph Lauren and somebody has upcycled it to 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 be like this. Merino and Angora wool and only 14. Just because I'm not sure that that's anybody's cup of tea here. But. Oh, who said that? Happy day. She's always so concerned with my channel growing. Let me just take a minute to appreciate that, y'all. She is. You wouldn't believe the emails I get. Her, her ideas. Just such good intentions for me. I'm so thankful for that. Thank you. Happy days. And so many of you are. But that she just struck me there for a second. That she, she just does that on here, off here. She's like constantly thinking of how to get my channel to grow. Like it's her channel. It is your channel, darling. You hang out here all the time, don't you? Okay. Up next. Up next. Up next. Oh, this is a little uh, nighty gown or a little, not bathrobe, but yeah, kind of like something to get out of the bath and shoot to the bathroom in case the teenagers are coming through. This is probably poly spandex. It looks as in also new condition. So I got it. There's no wear to it. There's your little belt. All right, darling. Cool. Let me look up and get you situated. It's a Laura Ashley. It's marked a medium. Yes. We are family. It's marked a medium, and I believe it is. It's just a soft, comfy, lightweight. There is what it looks like. 14, if anybody likes it. 14. This is no signs of wear whatsoever on this little out of the shower and, you know, or throw it on. Ever how? Y'all know how to do it. Y'all know how to do it. I ain't got to tell you. If any interest on that one. At $14. Uh, medium, it's marked for. Okay. Hi, Daddy. Thank you, Daddy. All right. Let's see here. Oh, I love this one, y'all. Hi, Brian. Welcome. Thanks for coming. Um, Hillary Radley. Great brand. Hillary Radley. This is marked a large. 
I love it. This one is great quality. Yeah, Gypsy, that's a great little thing there. And isn't it a gorgeous gray? And you can see here it's kind of ribbed. This is this has no wear to whatsoever. Doesn't look like it's ever been laundered. This is gorgeous. I'll do 17 on it. That's a, a clearance price because uh, this is a nice one. I'm not going to say it's a, a bulky at all. It's a medium weight. And I always love the little hem like this. And that is a little sheer white. Going to be great with a legging and boot. It's marked a large. Let me get y'all a measure. Oh, and let me check and uh, get um, bougie uh, registered. Awesome. Okay, y'all. 44 inches. So if somebody wants to be tried on, I will. It's a 17. It's a 44, I'd say 42 to 44 pits pit. Beautiful light heather gray. That is a nice sweater. Okay. We just need to get bougie fixed up right here. Yay. Oh, Laura Ashley. I didn't know it was that good of a brand. I really didn't. But that's great to know. I have Laura Ashley quite a bit. Miss Suzanne, I was thinking about you just now about that. I was like, that's a sweater that you would like. It's so pretty. Thank you, darling. I gotcha. I'm going to give away a little bundle today that I made up for Valentine's and I didn't give them all away. I've got one I'd like to give away today if I can hit my goal. I got to have goals. That's something I need to do a better job at, having goals. I know what it was I was going to tell y'all. All right. Let's see. Cool. I, thanks so much. Welcome to this channel. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. And I know everybody's give you a warm welcome. So, excellent. A lot of um, reseller friends that come in here with great jewelry, if you're into jewelry. Um, oh, I know what I was going to tell y'all. I'll tell you towards the end, okay? Because this is like woman-to-woman -woman stuff. I'll tell you towards the end. Okay, pair of shorts. These are new with tag. They are faded glory. They're uh, for a size 26. Size 26. There's a double button there. These feel like a, a soft, not too lightweight cotton. If anybody likes these, I'll do $12. And they're, and they're a nice modest. And mark for 26. I'm going to grab a waist on them. Knee with tag. <clears throat> Nice plus size uh, short, which we'll be wearing before long. They're a fixed waist, 44 inch, 44 inch waist. Okay. 44 inch waist. Those are nice. All right. Next up is a Candace Cameron Burr. Y'all familiar with her? She was on Full House. This is adorable. It's size medium. It feels like linen, but it could just be a nice cotton. It's 53 linen. It's half linen, half viscose. Adorable top. I'll do 16 on it um, for a medium. Very nice. Well made. There's your brand. 16. Soft, flowy. Linen and viscose. Okay? I love this. I'm missing what y'all are talking about, but I'm sure if you need to talk to me, 
uh, you'll get my attention won't you okay this we'll do a little discount on here rebecca malone medium this is uh never been worn it's still got a little see that back there that's cute size medium eight dollars eight dollars soft uh lightweight little t-shirt well like um yeah it feels like t-shirt and it's a cream i love that i love viscose and linen and i like rayon too but as far as how it lays on my body too okay next up we're going fast thank you jane this is by canvas which is uh you know they do lots of repops of old t-shirts this one's extra large it is so soft and it has this graphic on it and i'll do ten ten dollars on this um canvas it's an extra large super soft tee now this is the stuff that I don't put in the dryer because over time it could crack the extra large T right there. It's got a good length to it too. All right, next up, this little blouse. This is Crown and Ivy. It's you like that gypsy? You got it. Very nice. Thank you, darling. yay oh you you like that one darling yes you liked the message didn't you huh all right congrats to gypsy are we still holding your stuff this weekend darling or what you want to do you let me know this little top i don't know if becky's here well their melee can wear this too this is marked the medium if you're a tiny little petite, I suppose it's a dress. It has this little that ties in the back here. This is nice and soft, adorable. The back has the elastic at the back. It's fixed in the front. It's got liner and it's like, uh, it looks like eyelet. Isn't that pretty? 16. If anybody likes, and there's your little liner. I like how that actually just peeps through there at the bottom. And I can get a measure if you'd like. But 16 on this, it is marked for a medium. And it's a dress. I love that. It feels excellent, too. But it's not for a tall person like me. And it's not my size anyways. But, yeah. Real pretty and soft. I wonder what this one's made out of, actually. And let me do a pit to pit on that. I wonder, y'all, 34 inch pit to pit. I wonder, what if I, what if I upload video? What if I um, give an incentive to watch in the replays of my videos? What if I put a hidden message in it? during the live sale, and I don't know, I've got to think about something, you know? Okay, no interest on that one. That one feels so good, I don't know what it's made out of. Okay, next up. Next up. This is a top grain leather belt. If any interest on it. I'll do only $15. It's a nice one. Do you like it, Gail? You like that idea, honey? My nose is running like crazy. It's not trying to run. It's itching me. What does that mean? Either money or company coming and my hands itching. Did y'all hear that? Money, company. Look, the hardware on this one's good. This is a nice belt for 15 bucks. Really nice. So much life in it. And let me get you a measure. I believe it's a men's belt. But, you know, it can be whatever you want it to be. Okay, well, I might do it. I might do it. Melly, do you have a sale tonight, honey? 
um, 43 inches on this belt. 43 inches on it. It doesn't say. It just says 3S22045 top grain slash genuine leather. And that's all. Oh, it's missing a, look, it's supposed to have another piece of hardware right there. I just noticed that. I don't know if anybody would notice it, but I just noticed it. Dag on that. Okay, I'm going to do it. Yes, it just, it came to me. Oh, you're going on at 10 p.m. tonight, y'all. If you don't know Melly or have Melly, you want to pick her up there, Melly's Jewelry Box, because she's my sweet southern sister. And I learn about jewelry every time I watch her. It's very interesting. It's like getting a history lesson of the arts of metal. And semi-precious metals, stones, whatever. And I'm not exaggerating. It is for me. It's interesting. It's like, you know, if somebody talks to me about wars and history, and if the way they present it to me, I can be so enthralled with that. But I'm telling you, my middle and high school teachers bored me to pieces. So I never thought I liked it. But anyway, um, I'm rambling. Ah. All right, let's see what's next. Um, this little t-shirt. Oh, I thought of my daughter-in-law on this one, but this is new with Tag. It's a like, great gift for a baby shower or something. Um, it says, for this child I prayed with that scripture. And on the back, it's like this. So, 10 bucks. Uh, I don't know if I did. I saw a lot of nice stuff, though, for sure. This is a size large. Looks like custom ink. Maybe somebody had that made or something. I have no idea. 10 bucks, size large, for this child I pray. Great gift. Um, this little outfit is adorable. I wish I had one. So you got the little soft white, kind of like fleece, but look, they're almost a flare leg. I think these are lounge. I think they're like lounge clothes, but they're in excellent condition and a little matching top. I'd wear this out. I don't know about y'all. And it's got, look at the bot. The edges are kind of scalloped a little bit. Isn't this adorable? Is it loungewear or is it wear out kind of stuff? I don't know. I'd wear it out. It's so cute. Or it's loungewear. I don't know. But I will do 16 on the set. These look like they're for a medium. The pant. I'm going to say it's for a medium. And then your top is a little more oversized, like a large. Okay, so if anybody likes this, I call it loungewear. It's a lightweight, too, so it's super soft and comfy. I'd love to have a kind of white or cream outfit like this, though. Absolutely. So, 16 on the set. Medium pant, a large top, I believe. Yeah, I'd wear it. That's me, too. I'd wear it to the grocery store or whatever, you know. That is so cute. Anybody? All right. Let's see what's up next. I have a new bathing suit. You can let me know if you're interested. Um, this I also loved. You got it, Millie. It's perfect for you. Perfect for you. I think it might even been made for you. Thank you, darling. Excellent. I love this. You'd wear it for a week. I love it. I'm glad y'all did too. I take big chances on everything I buy, you know? So I really hope you do like it. And I loved this one. This is 80% cotton, 20 poly. It's marked to size large. Are you ready for a cool sweatshirt? 
and it's nice and long. Excellent new condition. Make magic happen. What do y'all think? Oh, I love this. This one's 18. Uh, this one feels, this is like brand new. I think it is. There's a sticker on it. Nice, soft, lightweight, 17. This is a great one. Make magic happen. Is this a Disney or something? Because it looks like there. I don't know. But I love to just feel that, you know. Anybody like? This is a great one. It's It's got a good length to it, too. So it'd be great with leggings. See? So, I don't know. It could be a Disney. Let Making Magic Happen. Very, but the tag doesn't say that. But, uh, yeah, 18 on that. Okay, Universal Threads. Y'all know I'm picking up for the spring and summer because... We're going to have to, you know, change our wardrobe up a little. Um, I will do 10 on this, Universal Threads. And I hardly ever get the denim, little chambray denim. This is marked the XXL. XXL on this one. And it's like a soft chambray, flowy little denim. That'd be super cute over a bathing suit, too, if anybody likes it. If anybody wants a measure, um, it says XXL, but I have no idea. All right, picked up another um, denim dress. This one is a medium by A New Day. So nice brands. This is a darker denim. Classy look. This has pockets. A new day. We'll do 18 on it. That's a great price for you. $18. I'll do a measure if you like. It's marked for a medium. Oh, I just buttoned and it came undone. Yeah. Oh, nice. A new day. Medium. And oh, I love it. Oh, this one has some nice long sleeves. And let me see the belt. It buttons all the way down. I have yet to get me a denim dress. I want a denim dress and I want to wear some brown cowboy boots with it. Which I don't have yet. But I, I can find me some. But I need the denim dress too. So I'm just trying to give you a, a little idea. On that denim dress. Super cute. It's coming to right above my knee. If anybody would like a measure, just let me know and I'll get it for you. In excellent, beautiful condition. All right. All right, let's see what's up next. See if anybody likes this top. So, this is a Kato's. I can try this on if y'all would like because it does look like it's going to fit a 2X. I love those nice, large, um, I can't even think of my words right now. Kato's. It's marked to XL, but I believe a 2X could wear it. And isn't it beautiful? Look at the, the beadwork on it. Can y'all see the, can y'all see that? Isn't that? 17 on it. 17. Poly spandex, nice and long. And guess what? It's got the black waistband, which is very flattering and slimming down there, my opinion. This one has nowhere whatsoever, and that is just a beautiful gray with the yellows, three quarter sleeve. And let me go ahead and get a measure. I'll get it measured without stretch. But I swear I think a 2X could wear it. It's Mark XL. And Pitch Pit. Pitch Pit. 42 inches. 42 inches. Length. 
nice long length of 33 inches. So that is a beautiful top if you like it. Of course, it's always if you like it. Yeah, I loved it. Very nice. Anything that print looks, looks, y'all. Okay, I have one in about every color of these. These are the so soft, lightweight, kind of almost like a flowy sweater. Van Heusen, great brand. So I took about every one of them in different colors. I hope somebody will like them. They're size large, and I'm going to do only $16 on them. These have no wear to them whatsoever. Don't look like they've ever been laundered. And, of course, I had to go with the pink because, well, this is more of a, like, maybe magenta. Beautiful Van Heusen, size large, nice and long, nice and long. And these are whatever I said, 16 each. Let me get you a measure because I have um, different colors of them. They all, if they're marked to large, should be the same because they're the same style. Um, 44. 44-ish. That's without stretching it. And like I said, no bulk added. It's the soft, flowy type sweater. I had the pink. I'll get to the other ones here in a second. Oh, I, I'll get to the other ones here in a second. Yeah, that's a great deal. I have brown. Uh, I have green. Here's the green. It still has the tag on it. Um, again, large. This was a $68. These are $68 items. I'm showing you right here for 16 bucks. This one still has the tag. Mark to size large, 44-ish, pit to pit. The sleeves are, look like they'd be a little tighter. 16 bucks. There's the olive, size large. Okay, I feel like somebody's going to love this. Now, I pick up these dresses. They're probably polyester. Don't put them in the dryer. And they're for fun. They're not going to last you forever, but they're, I can't resist them. They're brand new. And look at this one. I loved its print. You could wear this like around the house. You see, it's just that not much tight to it. It's fixed. There's no stretch, but isn't it so cute? Nice and long. $12. $12 if you like it. It's marked a medium. I think it's adorable. Medium. Brand new. It does have pockets. I'd wear it around like a moo moo myself. Um, but. I know, I think Happy Days would have loved that one if that were her size. Mark to medium. All right. Cha-Cha Venti. Cha-Cha Venti. I got this just in case anybody might like this type of style. This is a medium. Okay, Millie, I'll measure it. Yep. Sure will. Measure, measure, measure. I absolutely will. What's love got to do? Got to do with it. What's love but a second-hand emotion? 36. Well, maybe 34. It's between 34 and 36. Pit to pit. Late. Is 47. Length is 47. So. And girls just want to have fun. Whoa, girls, they want to have fun. They just want to. They just want to. You got it, Melly. What did we do? 12 bucks on that? Oh, that was great. I surprised myself. 
<laughs> I'm surprised myself. All right. Melly, 12. Yep, yep. Hooray. Thank you. Congrats. That's so pretty. All right. I know why I did 12 because of the um, um, quality. Yeah, I did 12. Okay, up next, well, there is the, um, well, this isn't Van Heusen. This is by Marled Reunited Clothing, size large. That's new with tag. There's your brand. And I will do, let's do 12 if you like it. 12 bucks. That's gorgeous. I love that sweater. Again, it's the soft, flowy, lightweight. And that does look like a true large. And this one, I like that it has a little more uh, room in the sleeve. It's a great price for you if you love it. New with tag. This is great because, you know, spring, we still have lots of chili. Like, it's really chilly cold right now. And this top, I just love. I wish I had one like it. I love the bottom like this. Hi, Southern Belle. Welcome. How are you? I hope you're well. So this is like thin, soft t-shirt on the inside. And you have got like a, a sheer, flowy cover. Beautiful little top. 16 on this. Look at the bat wing which is that um, you could put your arm in. Oh, I wish I had one of these. I just want to put it on, but I can't. It's a medium. It's a medium. But I love them when they have the waist such as this, that little poof there. And look at those beautiful. Yeah, I said it's sheer, but you can't see. You can't see. See? Anybody like that one? And it has a liner in the torso. Feels like real good quality. I've never had that brand. Cha-Cha Venti. But, um, yeah. Very nice. I have a Harley shirt. Anybody into Harley here? I used to sell a lot of Harley. Um, don't really anymore. But this one is a size XL. It's a long sleeve. It's so soft. I loved this one. It's got the down the sides of the sleeves. There's the back. And this one is actually just up the road from me. Uh, Wilkesboro is. This one is a 2003. And we'll do 20 on it if you like. Actually, no. I'm going to start it at 16. Y'all, these can sell for good prices, no matter their condition most of the time. But this one's not perfection. Um, it does need a little launder. It's got a little black mark right there. So treat it. Try to get it out. And also, look, there's a little wear. See the little holes around the very edge? It wouldn't stop me from wearing it, but... Um, just want to make sure y'all see that. This is a, see there? That's why I dropped its price to whatever I said. What did I say, Jane? Uh, but either way, yeah, like I said, they sell for good money regardless. This is an extra large. Extra large. And it's it looks great, except for right around the sleeve. None of this is um, in bad condition. So, 16 bucks. Extra large. I'd wear it. That would look good. I don't know. I don't wear orange very often. Okay. This is um, adorable. I love this. Did the brute leave that in your washroom? Just kidding, darling. I have no idea. This, you can't tell it, but it is the softest little fleshy colored pink or rose. Um, 16, if you like it. This will fit a 2X beautifully. The only reason I didn't 
what it's got a little waffle like ribbed type texture is because um, I'm already so broad right here and this the little ruffle there adds to my broadness and it was a mu little much so that's that's that one this is an absolute new condition and like I said it's just a little like um, fleshy colored slightest hint of a creamy pink kinda barely so this will fit 2x it's a nice little top if you like it because I've tried that on it's a nice weight too at 16 okay next up well I picked this up this is a vintage men's golf shirt I didn't know if anybody might be interested yeah, I, I think it's fabulous. It's got that golfing graphic. It's by Cutter and Buck. It's a medium. It's 100% cotton. And this is what it looks like. This And this says Vantage Championship, which was a tournament uh, which everybody should probably knows about if you know golf. This one is great. 17. Only 17. This is an excellent condition. It's got PGA write-ups and like article type things. Um, men's medium cutter and butt golf shirt. I swear it looks like it would fit a large, but it is marked to medium. If anybody wants a measure for it, I'll get it. What year? I don't know, baby. How will I know that? Oh, it says 1988 right there. I don't know if that might be the year, but right here in the, like the write-up that's on it, it says 1988. Yeah, it says um, 116th Open Golf Championship Club Tent. Oh, this is a picture of their admission ticket. Pri oh, it's so cool. Price, $85, $19.88. Wow, that's what that is, 106 That's a nice shirt, y'all, for that price. I think that's like the admission ticket. That's what I'm thinking, um, if any interest. Very nice. Gypsy likes it. But I think it'll fit a large Gypsy, but this might be just nice to have to keep. It's in excellent condition. Melly's at 19. Down here it says um, on this one, Chicago District Golf Association, 5,000. That must have been what they won. Is that what they won, 5,000? It says, Penn Golf Tournament, something of Shanter Country Club, July. Oh, this is 1920 and 21st. This ticket for Friday only. That says 1940. Okay, these are, I don't know, y'all. I don't know what year this is, but these are different write-ups for different years. Say, Albans match. I don't know which, how, what shirt this is. I really don't, but it's in perfect condition. All right. Let me look somewhere else right here and see. 100% cotton. It's got a style number, 247-15. It doesn't say. But it's in excellent condition. Thank y'all. Anybody for 22 on it? We're at 20. Can y'all say it good? Okay, babe. I showed three nice dry fits earlier. Okay, Gypsy's going to get this one at 20. Is that right? Thank you, Gypsy. Thank you for your your bids, Millie. 20 on that. 20 for Gypsy. Girls, they want to have fun. Oh, girls, they want to have fun. All right. This I thought was a cute little top. It's Croft and Borrow. 
You're welcome. Thank you. It's a really soft, um, lightweight cotton, but it's not too thin. You could see through it. So very nice. And I will do 14 on this. It looks in excellent new condition. That looks like the eyelet kind of look right here along the neck. Little baby blue. Your um, sleeve has got a little, see how it's cuffed up a little. Um, marked a large, let me do a measure. It is Pitt's Pit. It is. Oh, and it also has that little embellishment on the pockets. So, Pit to Pit is 18 times 2 is what? 36? 36. 60% cotton. Anybody like that one? Um, brand new condition. All right. Here was the other sweater. No, this one. This is different. This is, a, I got this because it's a Kim Rogers. So very nice. Size large Kim Rogers. Beautiful. Beautiful. Perfect weight. And I just got this. I can put this up for next winter. I mean, red sweater. It's going to sail in the winter. It's um, excellent new condition. Kim Rogers. Uh, but if anybody would like to take it now, I'll do 16. And that's a great deal for it. You can really feel the quality in it. Kim Rogers, size large. Let me get you a pit to pit. It's also nice and long. And you have got a nice sleeve size to it. Matches the, you know, body of it. So, your measure here, Pitt's Pit, is 42 inches with no stretch. 42 with no stretch. And the length is about 28 inches. If anybody would like that one for 16. Beautiful condition. Um, this is a super cute little dress. Guess who it's by? It's by the Pioneer Woman. Her stuff is so pricey, isn't it? Do y'all have her dishes or any of that stuff? I didn't even know she made clothes. But this is a little dress. No telling what they charged for it. Pioneer Woman size large. It looks like an extra large could wear it, but I'm not 100%. I will give a measure. I loved the print. I loved it. I didn't either. But I got it because I know, you know, it's probably well made with her name on it. And I know it sells good, a good amount. But I can do a good deal on it. If anybody likes, I'll do 18. 18 on this like new Pioneer Woman. Large, soft, comfy, like t-shirt dress with a little bit more weight than that. And kind of like a prairie a little bit, doesn't it look like? And let me give you pit to pit. This is just the ultimate comfort. Um, this is a go to Dollywood in it to be comfy and still be cute. Um, 40 inch pit to pit. 40 inch pit to pit. That's why I said I think XL could wear it. And about a 35 inch length. Feels great. I'm sure it's a cotton. And um, up here, wow, her, I'll tell you, the seams are very much done. They're very well and reinforced. And wow, I don't see it like that a lot. Very nice. Good quality, y'all. It does have an elastic right there. So nice little dress, Pioneer Woman. I will be here tomorrow, y'all, with some jewelry. Okay, I love this outfit. I wish I had it. This is so soft you could sleep in it. It's by Perfect Peach. Isn't that a cute name? And it's a size large. It's a little t-shirt with your little skirt made in. You can cinch that 
there is no wear to this whatsoever. It's not so thin you could see through it, but it's soft and, oh, so comfy feeling. There's your little sleeve. This is adorable, is it not? Also has pockets. 18 on this one. It's nice. 18 on this little outfit. It's like two pieces of clothing in one. So it's going to be something of that nature. And you can cinch that. And that's coming just above landing up here on my thigh, just kind of above my knee. And um, like I said, it's it's got enough weight that uh, you're not going to see through. This is so cute. Has pockets. Doesn't anybody agree with me on that? Don't y'all think it's adorable? Uh, marked a large, let me do a measure. Pit to pit. Of course, it's got stretch. It's like got, it's like t-shirt material with a little more weight to it. Pit to pit, 38 inches. Okay, so looks like a true large. And as far as its length, you're looking about 40 inches. Isn't that cute? You know, I just thought of somebody who might like that. wonder if Tanya would like that. She looks like she's lost weight to me. I bet she could wear a large. What do y'all think? Because she loves the tie-dye. She could wear it around the garden, do whatever. I don't know. I don't know if she would or like it or if it's enough for her. But I want to... I want to put it back. If nobody here wants it, I'm going to put it back and um, kind of check and see if that would fit her because we could put it in our next box. I do that for everybody. Everybody. If I think of you, if it comes across my heart, I don't try to favor anybody. It's just whatever good thing comes to me to do. You know, you can't even take credit for the good you do, really. Because, well, you can. But the idea had to come to you. This is new with Tag. It was $36. It is by Taylor and Sage. I've had that before. It's a medium. This is an adorable little tank. It's soft t-shirt. It's like soft t-shirt right there in the back. In the front, you've got the different texture. Isn't that so pretty? Wow, time's flying. That was my reminder. Um, let's do 15 if you like. This is new with tag. $15. That makes me happy. Well, it just did grow a bunch for Jackson to come. I ha had to grow a lot. But thank you. That's such a nice compliment. This is so cool. 15, any interest? It's gorge. It's a small medium. Um, let's see. Oh, yeah, that's for Miss Suzanne. She wanted that, which I love that. Um, what's up next? Oh, I just love this top, y'all. It's Kathy Daniel, size large. Look how pretty that he is. Oh, I love it. This is so soft. It's great quality. Kathy Daniels. I, this is so cool. I love it. Large. Ah, the Madian silvery sparkle. I love this. Size large. Um, I'm going to do 17 on it. It's in brand new condition. Isn't it adorable? I think an extra large could wear it too, maybe. But I actually feel like I could wear it, but I don't know. Um, yeah, Kathy Daniel, size large. It's a great top. And it is so super soft, and you can just feel the quality on this one. Love. That will be so pretty with a white linen pant, y'all, or a blue linen pant, or yellow. Oh, I love this. It's not quite my style, 
but it might be one day soon. I know my style's changing. Gail, let me measure this. I, it's such a pretty top. Let's measure for you. There's Miss Suzanne. I didn't know if I'd talk to you to sleep. I think I could wear it. It's 44 inch pit pit. Yes, it's a vacation. 44 inch pit to pit. Ah, so you'll love this, honey. It is excellent. You're going to love it. Perfect. Okay. And that, what a great price on it, too. Sold to Gail L at 17. That was my Gail L, wasn't it? Y'all hang out just about five or 10 more minutes. Actually, what we'll do, Jane, if you'd like, is we'll go ahead and put our numbers in. And then I'll show like three or four or five more items we're going to be done for the day. And um, I will be back tomorrow. The link's already set for some more of the jewelry sale at like the $6 start and the $9 start. Um, I hope y'all will join me for the last sale of the week. And then invoices go out tomorrow night. But I can't believe how fast this week went by. I just can't believe it. And tomorrow I get to go see my baby. Yeah, it uh, it will then. Yeah, it will, babe. Sure will. So let me jot down a number. Jane, sweetie pie, let me write down a number. Let's see what comes to me, y'all. Okay. It came to me right here. And um, let's... I know y'all don't trust me, but I was just going to try to stick it right here somewhere, but it won't. No. Okay. Boop. Right up there. That's my number. Okay. Thank you, Happy Days. Have you been noticing that I smile when I end it? All right. Anybody like uh, Lily Pulitzer? Lily Pulitzer, great brand. Oh, Gail, I, I so understand. I so understand right now. Now, I could not have understood this, what, two weeks ago? But I understand it now. Uh, Lily Pulitzer, this is a brand new without tag, 100% Pima cotton. The quality's there. It feels great. Her, she backs up her name, I think. It has a uh, gold tone little buttons here. This is marked to extra, extra small, and it is. I will give you a measure. Y'all, if you're bidding on something, I know we're putting our giveaway numbers in for a prize. I'm giving away a little, little mystery jewelry bundle. I have this left over from Valentine's. But if you like an item, put bid and the amount. Um, I'll do 18 on the Lily Pulitzer. So it's so small, like a little girl could wear it. I mean, this is a small petite darling to wear this. I'm going to give y'all a measure, but I think a, a little preteen could wear it. Hi, Laura D. Didn't know you were here. Good to see ya. All right. Pit to pit on the little Lily Pulitzer is like, 30 inches length 33 inches okay hi nikki welcome i haven't seen you in a while thanks for coming um size six i don't know you heard my uh measurements it says it's a um extra extra small 30 inch pit to pit 33 inch length yeah and it's, it's so comfy and feels great so only asking that good price for it if you like it um uh, let's see what we had next well i don't know if anybody's interested in this coat it's ralph lauren i'll put it up for winter it is nice it's a petite large Excellent, beautiful condition. This is like a soft cream Sharpay blanket. Is that not a gorgeous Ralph Lauren jacket, y'all? Let me put it on, show you. So it's marked to large. 
it's not gonna fit me, but I'm gonna. Oh, I wish it would. I love, you know, they do such cool things on their jacket. See the collar? This is Mark Delarge. Oh, I love it. Zips and buttons. Oh, it's Sharpay lines right here. It's just perfect conditions. Um, I'll start this off at 75 this winter. I'll do 65 on it today if anybody's here and you're interested. That's a heck of a deal. No telling what it would sell for. It's beautiful condition. Uh, Mark's a large. I'll do a pit to pit on it. This is a gorgeous coat. It's not bulky. Look at the length on it. Just excellent. Just absolute great. Uh, if, in, if nobody's interested, we're not going to do a pit to pit. But this is uh, so very nice. Excellent condition. And I don't think you could beat the price. So, I love it. Hardware is all excellent on it. It's lightweight, but it's going to keep you warm. You know, I want to let Morgan look at this for a winter coat. But I'm telling you. We about don't need something such as this anymore around here, but I'm going to let Morgan look at this. She might love it. All right, we're going to see a couple of more items. Jane's going to let y'all know when to stop. Um, and I'm going to show you a couple more items here. Whenever she says stop, put it on Dolly. <laughs> yeah, I know, she looks bare. Of course, I picked up this little shirt because it's the sun and moon. Um, it's got a, it's a new tag. Briscoe brand, size medium. Oh, I know who this looks like. I love it. And let's do 14 on it. Perfect condition. Is that not an adorable, the sticker over it, but there's the man in the moon. And there's the sun. Great price. Medium. Navy blue. Love that little t-shirt, y'all. Just put bid 15 if you like it or whatever I said. A small could wear it also. Small, medium. I love that shirt, too. I love that shirt, too. <laughs> y'all, I can put something on Dolly. I'll put, does anybody want this little sweater vest? This is so adorable. It's by Wasimo. Wasimo. It's a small, oh, I love it. I wish I could wear it. I'll just show you one. This is for a little small, darling. Is that not adorable? Little lightweight um, sweater. Kaftan. It's got pockets. This is so cool. <laughs> If anybody wants it, I'll do only $16 on it. But for now, we will put it on Dolly. 16 bucks. This is super cute, y'all. For a small, maybe a medium. I love it. Jay, you tell me when. I'm going to keep showing a couple of items until you say. Nobody bought this gorgeous vintage gown. It's so pretty. I wish I could wear it. Third, I don't think it was ever worn. It's absolutely beautiful. Absolute beautiful. 25 if anybody likes it. It crisscrosses that back. Look how gorgeous it is. What color is it? It's a mix between blue and purple. So, the beautiful, uh, yeah lace there in the front and then all the way down it's like maxi length isn't that gorgeous oh my god i love it beautiful 25 bucks it's in perfect condition um let's say 
this to me, it looks like it's made for a medium. Um, but y'all be careful and blurple, yeah. Be careful, don't give your husbands a heart attack in this one. So it's a hundred poly, it's by Petra Fashions. It says size large. I'll do a measure if somebody's interested in it, but I think it's so beautiful. I'd love to try it on. <laughs> I mean, not I couldn't do that for y'all, but I'd love to try it on for me, but I know it won't fit. You know what I mean? Isn't that beautiful? That's kind of how it is. Oh, I love it. It's gorgeous. Any interest? I'll measure if somebody wants me to. Okay, are we shopped out? Are we shopped out, darlings? Let's do two more items. See if y'all like them, okay? Because Jane's about to put stop. This was a Ann Taylor Loft. Beautiful little um, skirt. This is, I don't know if you want to call it like a chambray denim. It's kind of what it's like. Lightweight, super thin. Beautiful. Ann Taylor Loft. It's marked a zero. I will measure. That's what the back looks like. Just made for looks with the little pockets back there. Isn't that beautiful? I'll do $16 on it. Only $16 on the Ann Taylor Loft. Perfect condition. It is 30 inch waist, 30 inch waist and 21 inch length. Um, there's the, uh, I told you every color in that Van Hughes and I'll probably put these up for winter, but there was the blue, the beautiful blue size large. Van Heusen. Look how nice and long that I'm only asking 16 for. I'll put them up for winter. I don't know if anybody likes this for like a boy or girl. It doesn't matter. This feels like the kind of like the dry fit material. Don't know if it is. It's polyester. SB Tech Cool Play. It's marked for a 2X, but it looks more like extra large for me. If anybody likes this one, it's got a cool graphic on it. I'll do 10 bucks on that, $10. Um, this will fit up to XL, maybe with a little room, like a blue dry fit. And lastly for today, lastly for today, oh yeah, I had every color, Suzanne, um, blue, um, olive green, um, fuchsia pink, oh, you want it, honey, you got it, okay, and Gypsy, you want that, yay, okay, hold on a minute, oh, oh no, I lost my pickup. Here's the ticket. Um, lost from my other ticket. You want the blue Van Heusen. You got it. Yeah, I mean, one of them had their new tags on. These are really, really nice sweaters. Um, I don't know if that's you or for daughter, but it's so nice. And yeah, about every color over here. If there's another color you might be interested in, you let me know and I'll show you real quick. And then I have one more top. Then I'm going to get Gypsy. And I have one more top. Gypsy at 10 for the basketball. Suzanne 16 on the Van Heusen blue. And then I have one more blouse to show y'all. And then I'm going to give away a little jewelry bundle for a thank you gift. For y'all being here today and shopping with me. I really appreciate it. This is so nice. Okay. It's more of a fuchsia color, I think. But let me show you. I showed it earlier. I've got it right over here. I 
I'm just looking for my little thing where I was keeping up with my goals. I lost it, so I guess I'm just hoping and praying. I think I hit it, maybe. I don't know. I hope so. I was trying to keep up. All right, the pink one is right here, sweetheart. It's also a size large. They're all made the exact same. They're very lightweight and soft. This one's arms looks a little smaller than a size large to me. So I want to point that out. I don't know if these are for you or for somebody else. But let me know if that's an issue or a problem. See, so this one's sleeves don't look. They look like they would be a little tighter to me. You want it, though? Is that fine? You got it. Tell me if you if there's a problem. Um, just trying to describe everything accurately for you. Thanks, doll. Okay, Jane, are you ready to put stock? Well, I hate I got all this way and I lost my little paper. I really do. I don't know where it went. Oh, I found it. Thank y'all, darlings. Yay, congrats. Okay. Oh. I don't know. It's fine. Okay, last top. Jane put stop. And while y'all are looking to see who won, I'll show you the last top. If you want to bid on it, put bid 16, and I'll show it to you. Here's what came to my mind. 84. Anybody get it on the money or closest without going over to 84. That is our lucky number today. And you're going to win a little, I think there's five to seven pieces in here of jewelry, different a little assorted mystery jewelry bundle that I did for Valentine's giveaways. I had that one left, so I hope you'll enjoy it. And here's the last top. I think somebody will like this. This is Southern Lady, size large. And I love Southern Lady. Excellent. This is probably poly spandex. It is so soft and comfy. The hardware on it, silver tone, in perfect condition. Gail, Gail, Gail A, Gail A one. I didn't even realize Gail was still here. All right, you got it, Gail. Y'all, uh, this is marked large. I think extra large could fit it. Isn't that great? Bid 16 if you like it, please. That is beautiful. Bid 16 if you like it. Perfect condition. Southern Lady Large. I'll do a measure. I hope somebody takes it. I think it's gorgeous. Perfect condition. Gail A. All right, darling. Oh, yeah, you, that's right, because you get to go see, you told me you get to go see your grandbaby tomorrow. Like me, we were so excited. Pit to pit on this one, honey, is, this has never been worn, absolutely. Pit to pit's um, about 42, plus it has a little stretch. I think I could wear it, but it might be a little form-fitting right there. But 42 inches, and the length on it is about 26 it's a nice top. It's a good brand. I love it. If you need me to try it on, I can. Because if you're close to my size, I don't know. There's the back. Um, yeah, I'll try it real quick. I think it'll be too tight right here. Plus, I've got a sports bra on, which isn't the right bra to wear with it. But I wanted to be comfy today. Oh, no, it fits pretty good. It feels great. I don't have the right bra for it, but it feels real good. I love it. It's like poly spandex. Yeah, a 2X can wear it. I like that it's long enough to cover some of that, too. So, if, if you know, if anybody thinks I'd like it. 
Um, it's a really nice top. Well, Melly, if I see you on tonight, I'll say hello. Okay, Suzanne wants it. All right, excellent. You'll love it. I'll say hello because around about 10 o'clock, I plan on be making my banana bread. You got it. Congrats. I would have no idea at all. And then who won? Gail A. You won this bag, honey. Well, I don't know if you have a box or not. But normally I hold on to it for a week or two, Gail A. And if so if somebody has something going out, I can put it in. But after a couple of weeks, I just send it on out. Does that sound fine with you? Because I don't remember if you have anything this week. But we could give it through next week and see if you get something and put it in your pocket. All right, y'all. I'll be back tomorrow. Good Lord willing and the creek don't rise. I'll be back with some jewelry for you. Okay? Oh, did she? Maybe she did. Either way, if she did, I'll put it in her package. I gotta write that down. Um, I hope y'all have a good night. Oh, I wish I could gypsy i would i have mailed that banana bread before overnighted it i paid an arm and a leg sent it to dylan when he was at um in oklahoma fort i was trying to tell y'all the base name fort polk oh gosh i think terrible anyway overnighted that young banana bread well i froze it after i did it to try to but that unthawed in no time but anyway it was good because it lasts a while it only gets better after a couple days so gail a for gift yes i hope y'all all feel better be thinking of you thanks gail you too We'll, we'll be doing that together tomorrow. I, I want to read them as a book. I don't know if anybody's done that yet. I'd love to read them as first book. But even if it's not his first book, I don't mind. I just want to read them a book. I love to read the books to the babies. It's so good to start reading to them just as, just as soon as they, oh, I will. I'll get some video. Love y'all, darlings. Jane, thank you so much for all your help. I hope y'all have a great rest of your night. And I'll see you tomorrow. The link's set. And um, we'll do some more 6 and $9 starts. On, I got some lots of nice stuff pulled for you. But um, in the meantime, maybe I'll see y'all over at Melly's later. Send it with your sweater. Okay, you got a sweater. Yeah, I will. I didn't remember. Sure will. Oh. Yeah, I was probably doing it that I wanted to get my work over with for the week. And just have the rest of the day to see Jackson and whatever. But probably will. But I hate it. Okay. Bye, everybody. Thank y'all for coming and spending time with me. I love you.